I'm ready to arrest all of them. Fuck them all. Let's get them, man. Legally. That is the American people, fellow Americans. Rush Limbaugh's on point. So is Chris Plant. So is Larry O'Connor. So is Mark Levin, the great one. Check it out, man. This is a mobile podcast. I'm One Sir Grove, OHGOE, rapper extraordinaire, defense contractor, U.S. government, defense contractor. Real talk, man. Fuck all these people in uh, D.C. and politics, man, who run amok and who flout the system. Fuck them all. Let's arrest them straight up, like legally. So, Barr, right, as we're hearing, as we're finding out, this guy is under attack because he did his job. So now, these socialists, that is Marxists, I'm not even going to fucking call them Democrats anymore. They're not Democrats. They're fucking socialists. They're Marxists. Fuck it. I'm just going to call them Marxists, man. Because socialism is one thing. The extreme form of socialism is Marxism. So let's check out William Barr. William is going to come right up here using multiple computers here. William Barr. So William Barr does his job. He comes under attack, United States Attorney General, by communist infiltrators. Well, the analysis on the news is correct. I believe his name is John. I want to give John credit. He was on the Chris Plant show. I think his name is John. Folks who were listening, who were attentive, who were following, they'll know um, if I'm right or if I'm wrong. But because I don't recall, and it was a few hours ago, I'll just go with John. But I think it was John. So John calls in the Chris Plant show, and he says straight up that he has a background in law enforcement, credentials in the law enforcement community, retired from the from the law enforcement community. And basically what William Barr can do, William Barr has the power to have the people who are trying to uh, request information illegally from him because that's that's what these these foes are trying to do, these fiends are trying to do. They're trying to they're trying to bend his arm to strong arm him. They're trying to bend his arm, to twist his arm is the idiom. They're trying to twist his arm, to strong arm him, to get him to release information illegally. So they're they're trying to coerce the United States Attorney General to break the law. That's what the Marxists are doing. The Marxists are trying to coerce the United States Attorney General, William Barr, into breaking not just the law, but federal fucking law. So he has the power to have them criminally prosecuted for their actions. That's what the fuck he needs to do. Straight up. Like, to end this shit, man, to just end it. They need to be arrested. It's time to arrest these motherfuckers, man. Like, flat out, fuck them. James Comey, government needs to arrest his ass. Just straight up. Just be like, dude, you're under fucking arrest, dude. You violated the law, man. You've committed so many fucking crimes. America's sick and tired of your fucking shit, dude. You sought to undermine America. Andrew McCabe, arrested. Should be arrested. Immediately. He should be fucking arrested for crimes against America. High crimes. Extreme. Extremely illegal acts. Treason. Attempting to overthrow an American president. They should be arrested, man. Straight up motherfucking arrested, man. Because I'll I'll, I'll tell you what, man. In government, if I were the president, I would have them arrested immediately. I, I would do everything in my power to have them apprehended, arrested, charged with high crimes, and, and criminally fucking prosecuted immediately. 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 It wouldn't have gone on this long, man. Shit would have been over a long time ago. Hillary Clinton would have been under fucking arrest. Look, they're trying... You think that's far-fetched? Does that sound fucking far-fetched to you? They're trying to impeach Donald Trump. These foes. These Marxists. So, so, the other way around is that Hillary Clinton gets arrested. Like, straight up. She's, like, under arrest. Because anybody committing espionage in America would be under arrest. And that's what she did. She committed fucking espionage. So why would there be a double standard? Why, why has there been a double standard? Put her in fucking handcuffs, dude. And arrest her. Is what the Department of Justice should have done a long fucking time ago. And Andrew McCabe. And Lisa Page. And Peter Strzok. And all their collaborators. All of them. James fucking Comey. 
All of them, dude. Robert Mueller for his unconstitutional witch hunt. Fucking arrest him, dude. It's really fucking simple. It's really straight fucking forward. So Martha Stewart, she goes to federal prison, right? She's fucking handcuffed. She basically, she's incarcerated. She goes to federal fucking prison. Has like over a billion dollars at the time. She's a billionaire. Wasn't a problem to have her arrested, was it? So so why is Hillary Clinton and James Comey and Andrew McKay, why, why, is, it, why is it so far-fetched to have them fucking arrested? They're involved in high crimes. They're, they're involved in fucking high crimes. Barack Obama, who gives a shit that he was, he was an American president? American presidents are, are limited in what they know. There are 30, 30 plus levels. There are 30 plus levels, 40 plus levels. Let's just go with 40. There are 40 levels of classified information above presidents, American presidents. President doesn't know every fucking thing, man. Who gives a shit that fucking Barack Obama, a fucking a cokehead, a cocaine user at Harvard University, which by the way, using drugs on and around the campus at Harvard is illegal. Is illegal, dude. It's a fucking crime. It's I'm pretty sure it's a drug-free fucking zone. So I didn't vote for that douchebag. I didn't vote for that fucking traitor to America. I didn't vote for that terrorist sympathizer, which means terrorist. I didn't vote for that fucking terrorist, man. Fuck him, dude. Fuck Barack Obama. He's a fucking terrorist in my book and always was and always will be. So do, do, do you think that it's far-fetched, man? Look at Richard Nixon resigned, okay? Barack Obama, dude, fucking terrorist. Hey, I can see him in handcuffs, dude. Federally indicted on criminal charges. It's not, look, man, they put Martha Stewart in prison. Martha Stewart, white Caucasian woman, media celebrity. I don't give a fuck about Barack Obama, Hillary Clinton, James Comey, Robert Mueller, any, all of them, dude. Former CIA director John Brennan, all of them, dude. Arrest them. Arrest them for fucking treason, dude. Arrest one of them for motherfucking treason. Arrest one of them for committing crimes against America. Dude. Dude. If I were president of the United States of America, these people would be under arrest. Under arrest. Criminally prosecuted, charged with crimes. There wouldn't be this endless talk of so-called investigations of the investigators. And I'm talking about, for anyone who doesn't know what the fuck I'm talking about. By the way, thank you for tuning in. I'm your boy, OSGOE1 Sir Grove. This is Casting 495 Celebrities Worldwide, C4CW. And if you appreciate this show, if you support this show, I, we, 495, appreciate you. What I'm talking about is this, and I mean that sincerely. What I'm talking about is this. The so-called investigators, the Robert Mueller witch hunt, which was a fake investigation. It wasn't legal. It wasn't legitimate. It was fake. It was fraud. He hired a bunch of people with conflicts of interest, people who are already from the outset of the investigation biased and against the president. That's what he did. He hired a bunch of people who were out to get the president. They were all out to get the president. Robert Mueller got scared. He got scared, man. He's fucking scared, and he should be. At some point, he realized that he was committing, which he knew from the very beginning, but he realized that it wasn't going the way that the socialists, that is the Marxist, had planned. He realized, dude, that it had backfired and that he was going to end up, man, criminally prosecuted himself. Criminally prosecuted himself. So he backed out. That's exactly what the fuck he did. He knew that he was ultimately going to be criminally prosecuted and this shit backfired. That's exactly why the fuck he ended this shit and it ended. And that's, and that's why it ended. Because And with, with no collusion, first of all, there was no collusion. And secondly, he knew he was going to end up in the future criminally prosecuted. Because what they did was they committed fucking crimes. The whole so-called investigation was a crime. It was illegal. It was unconstitutional. It was un-American. And the product that was produced that some people refer to as, a, as an investigation, that piece of paper in and of itself was an un-American product. That's not a that's not a product of the American government. It's not a real that's not a real American investigation. That was a witch hunt in America. It was concocted. 
It was all artifice. It was all deception. It was all a ruse. It was all distraction from to take away from Hillary Clinton and her fucking high crimes and her espionage. And it was a way to try to get back at Donald Trump and entrap Donald Trump and entrap Donald Trump and overthrow. That is usurp and depose Donald Trump. If I were president of the United States of America, I would fucking have those people arrested, man. They would be fucking under arrest. I'd have Robert Mueller under arrest. I'd send fucking the whole man, man, man. I'd send FBI squads to go and fucking have that dude arrested at gunpoint. I'd have him arrested, dude. I'd have Robert Mueller arrested, and I don't even give a shit, dude. I'd have Andrew McKay fucking arrested at gunpoint. I'd be like, you're under arrest, just like Martha Stewart was under arrest. You're under fucking arrest, dude. I'd have Lisa Page and, and Peter Strzok fucking under arrest. I'd send I'd send the FBI, their own FBI, to fucking arrest them, and I'd be like, you're under arrest, dude, for high crimes against America, for attempting to overthrow a duly elected president of America. You're under arrest for your coup attempt, man. I'd have fucking James Comey arrested. I'd be like, you're a piece of fucking shit. You're under arrest, dude, for high crimes against America. Just like you arrested Wesley Snipes for tax evasion, you attempted a coup against an American president. You're under motherfucking arrest, dude, and you're going to federal prison for like thousands of years, dude. I'd have them all arrested, man. They'd all be fucking arrested. And then you know what we'd do? We'd go back, dude, and we would tell the whole world. We'd we'd tell the whole world. We'd say, look, we're going to look at everything Barack Obama did. The fucking Harvard uh, cocaine sniffer. We're going to go back and look at everything this motherfucker did. And we're going to have his ass arrested, dude, for fucking crimes against America. For allowing the rise of ISIS. For helping facilitate the rise of ISIS. For his fake ass fucking Obamacare sham. The whole thing was fucking fraud, dude. Charging people double what they were paying and pretending like they're going to get universal health care. I'd have his ass arrested. Yeah, just like they were trying to just like they're trying to impeach Donald Trump and have him basically arrested. I'd have fucking Obama arrested for real. I'd really have his ass arrested, man. And he'd be sweating motherfucking bullets, dude. He'd be fucking sweating motherfucking bullets, man, because because he'd know that I'd make good on it. I'd absolutely motherfucking make good on it. And there wouldn't be any talk, dude. That that, that was frivolous. There wouldn't be any fucking talk. That's a joke. We're motherfuckers talking endless circles on the radio. I'd be like, yo, this is what we're going to do. I'm just letting the Russians, the Chinese, the Australians, the Africans, I'm letting the whole motherfucking world know Barack Obama's going to be arrested, dude, for fucking treason. All of them would be motherfucking arrested, dude, and this shit would happen immediately. I'm one Sir Grove.